conditioned. But then uh, I had a small piece of fluff in my ear. Could you say it again, please, Rabbit? All religion is true. want to hear it. I know it's four months old. Give me a break. <laughs> it took me that long to cool off from this. Because I, I, I saw this on New Year's Eve. I, I legitimately saw this on New Year's Eve and I could not believe my ears. I could not believe this guy CeeLo. Alright, so here's the deal. Is that he uh, sang the song and changed the lyrics to John Lennon's famous song, uh, and uh, it pissed a lot of people off. And actually, a lot of people thought that he uh, just messed the line up, that he forgot it. But CeeLo, me and you know what it really was, right? You got chicken shit. You're a little panty waste. You got scared to either offend yourself or others around you or your deity or some crap like that. And so what do you decide to do? I'll tell you what you decided to do. You decided to piss on the grave of what was perhaps one of the world's greatest singer-songwriters in history, one of the most prolific talents that we've ever seen, you decide to piss on his grave because it might make you feel uncomfortable saying there's no religion. So where does this bring us to? Who out there could we get to sing John Lennon's song in a proper fashion. I'll tell you who. This person. And no religion too. That's right, CeeLo. That's right, CeeLo. A little tiny girl. A little tiny baby girl. Smoked you. Smoked you, dude. She can sing the line, right? She has big enough balls to do it. But CeeLo, big old rap star CeeLo, no. No balls anywhere to be found. Not one. Get your ovaries and get the fuck out.